Have I found some cool fossils? Well, yeah. Yeah, I have. Like T-Rex right up there. Not just T-Rex though. I have worked on other types of ceratopsians and even um, some bigger guys like the mosasaurs. My main specialty are theropods. Uh, and I got some, I got some friends right here that uh, keep me, keep me busy throughout my day. I've also worked on so many hadrosaurs, like so many, I'm still kind of working on some of them. But give me a raptor any day of the week and I will be so happy. You're probably asking exactly who have I worked on? Well, we got the ceratopsians here, like your chasmosaurus. Like I said, we've got the hadrosaurs, so animals like hadrosaurus, edmontosaurus, all the orisuses. Orisuses? Hmm, I don't know. Problem is, some of the dinosaurs that I've worked on in the past are just too big to even have in our museum. And when I say big, I mean like, yeah, like two stories, and that is just a forelimb. It is just the front leg. The smaller sauropods that I've worked on, like Diplodocus as well as Suawasia, are two that we can put into our museum. They're just, well, our, our museum's kind of full. Yeah, we're, we're pretty filled. Pretty filled up. Oh my god! But that's the thing. I'm going back out. I'll be working on Diplodocus. I'll be working on Allosaurus. Uh, some other ones that I don't know if we can talk about just yet because we're still unsure. But it'll be all the dinosaurs. If you guys want a tour of Dinosaur Hall, where I manage all of our beautiful mounts here, I keep them nice and clean. Don't look at them right now, they're still dusty. And also make sure that they're being properly managed and, you know, taken good care of. We want these guys to enjoy their second life, you know, in a museum. Like this guy right here, our Corythosaur, that is mainly real. And so I have to make sure that the mounts are stable, making sure that none of the fossils are gonna, well, fall. Trust me, you don't want that thing falling on top of you. Look at that. I've had so many nightmares of cleaning this guy and it falling on top of me. Yes. Make sure you follow along when it comes to what I'm doing here at the academy here or out in the field to see what I bring back to my museum to talk about and uh, the other cool stuff that we've got going on. Albertosaurus wants you to follow because look, uh-oh, this old man, old bro.